went to the comic book store today. <clears throat> I don't really do this because, but yeah, I'm going to do it today because I've been seeing this one. A lot of people have been saying this has been sold out. And um, people just say that to try to make a sale and get get a lot of money. But like, they had thousands and thousands and thousands of all the covers. And I'm not sure which cover this is. I'm thinking it's the original one. It's the first printing, Spawn Kills Everyone. And they had them with the gun, they had them with the Captain America shield. Had this one, I think a few others on the shelf. They had like thousands of every cover today. And they're just $2.99. And I just wanted to make this because people, I've been seeing people give like 10 and 20 bucks a piece for them. And like my comic book store actually has books on the shelf from last year still on the shelves <clears throat> like when everyone was buying that the uh, death of Dr. Octopus or whatever it was I had him on the cover I found that on the shelf like a year later and um, I got Predator versus Judge Dredd versus Alien number two it's a really good one Yeah, can't get a good picture. All right, and I got Spawn 257, and there and my comic book store still has Spawns from 230 and 240 something still on the shelf. So I might go pick them back up because I ain't really been interested in them because of the bad artwork and stories. But yeah. I got a Spawn 265. This one is actually going to get me back into reading Spawn. See, back in the 90s, we only had one comic book store in the state of Kentucky. And it shut down. And comics, you couldn't pick up comics like you can today. And like you only get, like, if you're lucky, one comic every four years will come on the shelf at Walmart. And that's the only way you could pick up comics. Other than that, they wouldn't sell comics anywhere. And then all of these <coughs> are from the dollar box. And I, I, I have a lot of Spawn comics. Now I picked up two that I've already had. So that's Spawn 25 and 16. I've already got these and I didn't know it at the time. I, I got like a huge stack of Spawn comics. Probably about that big. 27. Uh, e even issue number one is in the dollar boxes. Even issue number one is Spawn's in the dollar boxes. Because they're not worth anything anymore. Back then, issue one was worth some money. But like now, they're just in the dollar boxes. Spawn 33. I like that cover. 14. Sixty-five, and this one looked really boring. And it's a lot of dialogue, and it just looked like flashbacks, so I didn't read it. Number sixty-five, just picked it up because I needed that one. Uh, 
Uh, freak Force number six. Cyber Force invades Freak Force number nine. I love Freak Force. <clears throat> I was born in 88, so these are probably before my time. I don't know. I wish they never got. I wish Freak Force and the Deadly du Duo was still around. I never did like. I never cared for Savage Dragon. I always thought he was boring. It's got Savage Dragon in it. Freak Force number 10. Everything's falling, people. My camera is acting funny. Eleven. Sixteen. And I might go back later this month because they had a ton of savage dragons not i think they also had like one or two freak forces that i missed and like okay even like the wolverine and deadpool appearance they're in the dollar boxes and people was trying to sell them because they're saying it's low print run but they're in the dollar boxes they had like tons and tons of bronze age comics Tons and tons of Batmans from the 70s and 80s and 90s and 400 and 500, 600, 800s. And um, this is number 17. They also had a dead bunch of 90s Deadpool in the dollar boxes too. But I never cared for it. Number 18. Savage. Ugh, Savage Dragon. Number 22. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, baby. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Savage Dragon crossover. He looks like a turtle. Savage Dragon 30. Only got that one because of Spawn. Cool cover. Deadly Duo, one. Number three. I've already had two. Number three. This and Freak Force should have never ended. And number four. This, this is probably one of my favorite image comics. This and Freak Force. The Spawn. I was hoping Mars Attacks will come back. They'll bring all the 90s image teams back and stuff. That would be so awesome. Yeah, and I might be going. I'm yeah, like I said, I might be going back and maybe pick up some more dollar books, more books off the shelf. So, peace.